Wood. Wall over in Westbrook. Uh, yo, what up? Welcome back, Cyberpunk 2077, episode 8. It's great. I'm staying up late. Let's go. Alright. Let's get back to where I was last time. Just getting my ass kicked by the cyber, cybernetic, cyber psycho, cyber freak. Hello, Ziggy. Thanks for having me. I hope you made it to the studio without any issues. No carjackings or mm. drive-bys along the way. <laughs> no, no. Uh, fortunately, the streets of Night City are getting safer every day. We've seen recorded homicides drop from 7,103 a year ago to just... Uh, hold on, hold on. The streets are safe, you say, but what about the highways? <sighs> I'm, I'm sorry? You heard about the shooting off the Route 1 exit, I trust. Half an hour before any response team arrived on the scene. Let's go! Oh, shit. Um... You know, not right now. I'm out of here. I... Oh, wait. What a fighter! He's gonna kill me again! Uh, I'm so scared. Okay. Uh, oh, there's 209. Ooh. Me likey. Booyaka. And it's an orange gun, I like it. Oh. Kill him! Oh. Sure. Please, no. Oh. I'm out of here. I'm not messing with you. You're cool. You're cool. You know what? Yeah, let's, I'm, I'm gonna. I'm gonna leave her alone. I like this gun, though. Yo, yo. Mm. Oh, there's a bike here. That's a pretty nice bike. Should I give it a go? Should I give it a good? Give it a good. Where you at, Shorty? I'm just, I'm not ready, I'm not ready for this. I ain't built for this yet. I ain't built for this. <coughs> I can't be dying so much with loading screen so damn long. Mm. Be fucking forever.
Oh yeah, y'all did right. Y'all did right. Installing update. This may take several minutes. Let's get the fuck out of here. Okay. Um. Actually, I'm gonna do what I said I was gonna do last time and do the fucking the Mama Wells job. Gotta go see Mama Wells. Can't leave her hanging, y'all. I mean. <clears throat> Ooh, Lord, oh Lord. What the fuck is going on? Sorry y'all, I ain't got time for y'all bullshit. Not even got my own shit I got to do. Kabuki. Little China. I'm swerving. Oh boy. Oh. Ooh, oh. Yeah, see that's why I like riding a bike. I'm I'm way way smoother. 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 Smoother maneuver. I never fall off this bitch. Okay. Get the fuck out of the way. Okay. Oh shit, did I hit him? I must have like skimmed him or something because it doesn't seem like it. Alright. Shooty doop. Mmm. Good thing that was a hologram. Let's go. Yeah, I hope you guys notice I got a different mic now, so maybe you guys can hear me better. I hope so. Maybe I'll actually get some fucking views now. I hope so. But you know, I'll just get the channel looking better and better over time you know what I mean let's go almost there to mama wells <clears throat> yeah I like I like bikes in this game not cars I prefer the bicycles the motorcycles oh damn Ooh. she got dragged Get the fuck out of the way. Get the fuck out, get the fuck out. Oh, man. Oh, oh, man. Getting too many people. Police looking for me, man. What? Really? It's pretty massive. So maybe we scorch it. We'll How many combat? The police? Get the police? Where the police at? I got to hide. right over there. Alright, maybe my warrant will just wear off. 
said every guy with a warrant ever. Okay. Yeah, we're just going there. Oh, now it's gone. Alright. <clears throat> Sorry, guys. Give me one second. About to catch a strange snitcher. Make a mucker. Back to back to in a back to back to. <clears throat> Do a little quick adjustment of some things here, you know. I'm making a hat and cat and. Booyaka! Okay. Sorry, y'all have no reference of, of what the fuck I'm doing behind the scenes. But, uh. Yeah, no. <clears throat> okay. Looking good, looking good. Let's just talk to my world now. V. Nice to see you. Okay. Sit. Sit. You want a beer? Sure. Wouldn't mind one. Salud. A lot of time has passed. How you been? <coughs> Hanging in there somewhere. <coughs> Somehow, you could have come over for dinner. Nuestra casa es tu casa. Hmm. But okay. We put it behind us. Hmm? I am in the middle of preparing an ofrenda. There is still so much to take care of. Could help you with that. Gracias, mi cielo. But I will manage. It's enough you come to say goodbye. I want to take part in the ceremony, but I want to do it the right way, in line with tradition. Mm -hmm. But something I'd lay by his casket, that would do justice to his Make memory. Not leave. <laughs> I don't got, got anything. An arm. Mm -hmm. And but your shoulders. Heart is in the right place. <laughs> I got shoulders. Don't worry. He's symbolic. Look for something in his garage. His past is all there. Jackie had a garage? He used it for his motorcycle, mostly. But not so long ago he moved in. You'll find something there, I'm sure. You won't mind me digging through his stuff? No, mijo. He's gone, and funerals are for the living, not the dead. Toma, take the key. Thanks, Mama Wells. Ah, don't mention it, V. You have respect. I admire that. The garage is on Republic. I de veo. Ivy. You here alone? This is not exactly the safest neighborhood in town, Misty. I used to sit on the stairs when I was 10. 26 now. If anything was gonna happen, it wouldn't have taken this long. What are you doing here? Sitting and waiting. And yeah, waiting for him. Though I know he's never coming back. Lately, I've just been coming here to sit. An hour. Sometimes two. I know it's gonk, it's just... I miss him. A lot. Mm. Wanna sit? Catch up? Hardly gonk at all. Just, well, human. I guess. Jack talked about you a lot. Always saying how much you meant to him. 
Did he really say that? I bet he used different words. <laughs> Maybe. But that's what he meant. I really believe that. You actually got to know him. The real Jackie. Everybody else thought he was a goofball with a rough hewn face and an edge. But they're wrong. <laughs> I miss Jackie. My road dog, bro, my road dog. Wait, hold on. You actually have to know him to know Jackie and everybody else. Nah, he was goofball. What did you see in him? Let me tell you what he told me once. Told me he'd take a bullet for me. In an instant. Even if it'd kill him. Spoken like a true Haywood boy. A man. With dreams. Ambitions. Only thing they cost him was his life. There's a huge chunk of his past in there. Mama Wills is having a send-off for Jackie. We need to find something he really cared about. You mind giving me a hand? I'm not sure I should go in there, V. Still too soon? No, it's not that. Mama Wells and I aren't exactly on the best terms. She wouldn't want me touching any of his things. Disturbing the memory. That I know. Jackie would want you here. That's more important. Come on. <clears throat> Come on, Charlie. Oh man. Jackie's garage. It's a fine piece of metal and mechanics. He was so psyched. It's a nice bike. This is a nice bike. Mm. Oh man. I'm not gonna take anything from here. Disrespectful. Box it up. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean. Oh, Jackie. That, that a mandala? Damn. Oh, it's a long story. Hey, you all right? I'm so much better than all right. I once told Jackie he should sweep all the dark energy out of this place. A sand mandala would do the trick, for example. He told me that out of sand he'd build a castle, a home, the Wells family hideout, stronghold, something. I guess you made a bigger impression than you thought. I guess I did. It's beautiful. It's hideous. But it's also the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Sam is hideous. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> it has potential. He didn't finish it. You didn't give him a chance. It's amazing. No, I'm not taking Jackie's money. No way. Straight into tequila. I can't read his messages either. His belt. Uh, Holes, Ernest Hemingway. Jack read it a dozen times, always right before a big job. He said the guy who wrote it was tougher than Morgan Blackhand. You read it? Is it any good? I, I never got the chance. It'd be a good tribute for the Ofrenda, though. 
Jackie loved to pump iron, didn't he? He called it his form of meditation. He used to say, barbells are the best listeners. They understand all your problems and never give you gonk advice. Basketball signed by Dante Gonzalez. He was from Haywood, too. Everyone here shot hoops. Dante ran circles around him. I think he might have been the first kid to ditch the Valentinos. Like Jackie. Mm -hmm. They both wanted more out of life. Dante's captain of the NC Blackouts now. Jack, pure and simple. Well, you got something for your ofrenda, but we could look around a little more. An aquarium. It used to be tacos. And taco was. This fish, a dwarf shark, like mini. Sounds like a mighty expensive fish. Oh, I don't think he bought it. Another belt. Sort of a memento. His dad's used to beat both Jackie and his mom with it. Until one day, Jackie fought back. Kicked his butt. Told him he'd kill him next time. Old man was hospitalized, and then he left. Why'd he hold on to it? In case his dad ever comes back. It's gotta be Jackie's dad. Old school ganger. Valentino's, of course. Did you meet him? No, I only ever heard about him. But he didn't exactly inspire many fond memories. Can't take the photo. What else is there to scan? There's nothing to scan. I'm not gonna scan anything though. Okay, let's try to get going. <coughs> Actually, V, I think I'll stay a while. Say bye to him here. Mama Wells wouldn't want me there anyway. You gotta come, Misty. You got a right to be there. I'd rather not get in Mama Well's way. It's for family. You were family to him. I guess you're right. Thanks, V. So, shall we go? Let's go. I'll see you at the Coyote then. Oh, Valentino. I never, I, I never bought the Valentino before. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> My deepest condolences. He was a fine boy. Then go raise a glass to him, Padre. A few glasses. De acuerdo. P. Jackie, man. It's Jackie. good you're here. We're about to start. Sit down, please. Maybe. But for the friend of though. Um, oh, everybody's supposed to have their own thing. Okay, okay. I get, get, I got you. I've never. I thank you know. all for coming today. I'm not going to tell you what kind of man my son was, or lament about how much I miss him. Instead. I'll tell you a story. When he was about 19 years old, Jackie was in the Valentinos. They were at war with Maelstrom back then. I get a call from the hospital. They tell me he got shot three times, just by the heart. He was conscious when I get there. So many tubes coming out of him. He looked like a, like a pulpo, like an octopus or something. He tell me, he said, no te preocupes, mama. 
Look, I'm bulletproof. Nothing bad will ever happen to me. And when I go, he take off his Valentino's ring. <clears throat> he swear he won't need it anymore. But he was not scared. He just didn't want me to worry. Mm. Descansa en paz, mi hijo. Among the membership of the Night City Devils Boxing Club, we had this saying. Make your best friends among the fighters who knock you out cold. And it's true. Jackie's arm was a cannon. No one's ever hit me as hard. <laughs> I can still almost feel it. Twelve rounds, buddy. Me mandó Camporta. Lamenta no estar aquí. Todavía le quedan cuatro años que cumplir. Me pidió que leyera esto. Recuerdo cuando Jackie se nos unió. Era un niño fuerte. Cuando decía que iba a hacer algo, cumplía. Tenía olor, ol, ol, honor. Podría haber llegado lejos. Mis condolencias a la familia. Que descanse en paz. Anyone else? I, uh... I often think back to the first time me and Jack met. I'd been hired to drive him and some contraband across the border. He bought some goods clipped from Arasaka. Top secret. Priceless. <laughs> A lizard. And, uh, I remember what he said then. That I came from a place where everyone's family. So he must be too. Jackie Wells. An honorable man. He placed principles first and stuck hard to him. Once he set his mind to something, he was ready to die to achieve it. He once told me, Broder, the one thing we can't do is be afraid of others. For his loved ones, he'd sacrifice his life without hesitation. But most importantly, Jackie loved life and had no fear. <laughs> Awkward pause. Part of his sleeve, he didn't overthink things. He just went for it. Thought he was bulletproof. And, and that he become legend at the afterlife. And ultimately, he did what he set out to do. Shit in the shoes of some powerful people. And if he's watching, I bet just about now, he's flipping them all the bird. When you go to war as a boy, you have a great illusion of immortality. Other people get killed, not you. Then, when you are badly wounded the first time, you lose that illusion. Rest easy, Chu. I would like to say a toast. Or mi hijo. Thank you for your kind words, I'm glad you're here. It was a beautiful ofrenda we gave him. A lot of people come today. I don't know Even that putika Jackie was messing around with. Her name is Misty. What? Misty. And she was very important to him. Do you understand? Go. Invite her along for dinner. It's the least she deserves. You know what? You're a good man. Jackie would want you to have these. Thank you, but... I really can't accept this. 
I hope you understand. Cuídate, B. Wait, did I just deny the bite? No! 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 How do I crouch? No! I'm on my knees. Okay, um. I want that bite. It's a nice bite, actually. Uh, gonna mess up. Nah, I'm gonna reload it. I want that bike. I want that bike. I want that bike. I want that bike. Okay. Um. Yeah, right there. Sorry, guys. <laughs> but I'm reloading this shit. Yeah, dig. Okay. Man, my speech was all good and shit. You know what I mean? I deserved that. I was a good one. I'm just convincing myself now. I I just want the bike though, because I've been wanting the bike. So why not take my homie, my best friend's bike? Yes, what? Yes, I'll take that. When you go to war as a boy, you have a great oh, illusion of immortality. Other people get killed, not you. Then, when you are badly wounded the first time, you lose that illusion. Rest easy, Chiu. I would like to say a toast. Or mi hijo. Thank you for your kind words, B. I'm glad you're here. It was a beautiful offering that we gave him. A lot of people come today. Even that putika Jackie was messing around with. Her name is Misty. What? Misty. And she was very important to him. Do you understand? Go. Invite her along for dinner. It's the least she deserves. You know what? You're a good man. Jackie would want you to have these. You... You sure? Jackie would kill me if I got so much as a scratch on it. So don't get any scratches on it. Thank you. I'll take such good care of it. Cuídate, B. Damn, that felt like I got a camera out of it. <sighs> Better not hit shit in Jackie's bike. Camus all torn up. Says he feels like he lost one of his own. miss him. I wonder if he'll be as torn up after. Already do. Oh, got him. <laughs> start Me too, today. cabron. Not today. Me too. Here's to Jackie. Got off to greener pastures. Jackie Wells. Proud son of Haywood. Well, uh, I should mingle, Vic. Sure. See you later, V. Pour you another for Jackito. Pour for Jackie. Amen, brother. Weird being here without Jackie. Can't shake the feeling I'm gonna turn around and see him sitting at the bar. In his favorite spot, where he always used to sit. Hey, you! Have a drink with us. Hmm? To Wells?
How'd you meet Jackie? We started out together. In the Valentinos? No, in the fucking Bible Book Club. Yeah, I got only good memories of him. Rest easy up there, brother. I think we might know each other. Gustavo Horta. V. Yeah, I've heard about you. Well, heartfelt condolences, friend. From me, Campo, and all the Valentinos. Thank you. All right, why not? To Wells. May he rest in peace. Good for now, thanks. See? Gotta know when to stop. Aye, give me a break. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Hey. Are you alright? Yeah. I think I'm just still in that garage, mentally. I just need a sec. I got a bike. You uh, here to say goodbye to one of your own, Padre? I'm here to say goodbye to a good man. So, Padre, you think Jackie's looking down upon us? From up there? I believe he has met God, stood before him. That's it. I don't know if God left the meeting happy, but I'm pretty certain Jackie did. Jackie? Do you know him well? I remember the day his mother brought him into this world. The day his father left. The day he took you into his home. Yes, V. I knew him quite well. How are things in the streets? This is Great. not the place to conduct business. Have some respect. I'm gonna move on. Go with God. Awkward way in that conversation. Alright, I'm going about my business, y'all. Some shades and bombs. Oh, I thought they were red, but it's just a reflection. I need some red aviators like that. That would be dope. Ah. What? Don't look like fucking Zoro. All right. Um, let's go. Oh, I leveled up. Oh, nice. Yeah. Y'all know what the f this is, boy? Thought this was. Thought I was playing out this bitch. Water. I'm playing out this bit water. Um, I'm gonna increase my attack speed. I'm gonna be the fastest motherfucker with the blade. Go to the afterlife. Actually, no. I wanna, um,. What's this mission? Ghost town. Go track down. Hellman. Oh yeah, no, 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 no. Not doing that right now. I'm gonna go meet with Takamura. Someone told me I do. <laughs> okay. Sorry, guys. Woo. Gatito Spike. Oh! 
that was cool. Yeah, I still gotta buy my own bike though, so. <laughs> Not so imminent, you know what I mean. I can make my money at my leisure. I'll lean on the barrier and wait for him. Lean on the barrier. Lean on the barrier. I'm leaning, y'all. I'm leaning. It is good to see you, B. Seems pretty, uh, secluded here. It is appropriate for such a secret meeting. What the hell happened? You look close to awful. You see a man robbed of his implants, money, and dignity. Look well. It is not all bad. I am mostly unnoticed in the streets. Friend you mentioned here? Oda. He should be here any moment now. Willing finally to give me the spec on him? He's Hanako-sama's bodyguard. Hanako Arasaka's, from the carrier at anchor in the bay, Saburo's daughter. Yes, and if he believes you, we'll next meet with her. Sure you can trust him? Yes. <laughs> Convincing, very. I have nothing to lose. Is that better? Worse, because I got plenty to lose. By God, huh? A good sign. He is usually camouflaged. Dramatic injury. Bro, if you don't just walk over here and talk. God damn it. Come on. Takemura san. Oda. Is this him? Your thief. He's my witness, B. 
can speak for myself, you know. So speak. I have been told you know things. Not gonna like what I'm about to say. I need a guarantee I'm safe here. You are, you have it. B, you can trust Oda. All right, then. Oda? Oda Sensei? Kempeki Plaza. I was there the night it happened. Looked like your typical family quarrel until Yorinobu like lunged the creator and Sapporo of One Piece started Oda? Silence! Not one word more. You will bring death to your door. But it is the truth. Hanako-sama must hear it. My one concern is to keep her safe in this city forgotten by the gods. Is she in danger? Now? No. Yet during the parade to honor Arasaka-sama, most certainly, I bring you this witness to his murder. And do you dare to worry about the silly parade? Fool! Correct. But you I'm can't ready. ignore the truth. Can they run a BD from me? Unlike you, I have not yet failed to keep my oath to do my duty. You will regret those words. The only thing I regret is that I came here to meet you. There is a price on your head. I do you. Sorry, but this is gonna take much longer. Can I, I move? do you a favor now by not cutting it off and taking it straight to your noble summer? What would you do now, were you in my place? I do no favors. I would deliver you ahead to Yorinobu-sama. Consider yourself Raki. Oda, that... not like we're asking for a whole lot here. Just one brief meeting. Hanako should decide if what we say is true. You can't decide for her. Will you help? I will not. But I will let you leave this place, this city, unharmed. If I see either of you again, I will not be so lenient. Be very careful, my friend. We Damn, are all so far from home. You just kill him. Good fucking riddance. One hour soccer whack job is already plenty. Fine friend there. Got any more? Alas, only him. No way this is gonna work. Mm, yet. We walk away with a small measure of success. Hmm. How do you figure that? What Oda said. They returned to Tokyo after the parade. Do you not see that parade? It is our chance, perhaps. If, somehow, we can get to Hanako-sama. We must do a proper reconnaissance first. We'll need a precise map of Japan Town. Hold on. It is your turn to call on friends. Do you know a fixer who could help? Uh, hang on. Not so fast. It could sound as easy as hacking a schism. You said yourself, Hanako's got the tightest security in all Night City. Correct. That is why I wish for you to contact us with the local fixer. No, just the fixer dame. Wakaku Akata runs a pachinko parlor on Jig Jig Street. We must pay this woman a visit. Will you join me? Sure, why not? What was that, buddy? So I guess you're driving. But how am I gonna get in there? Hey Judy, what's up? Hey. Can you come you must go to this street. Something Jean. happened. Jean? Yeah. Uh, how did to say? Bro, I can't even get in there. Lady. I cannot go alone. 
I can't get in your fucking car, bro. Oh, shit. I might as well just fucking You must go around. to this street. G. G? Uh, how did you say? Oh, man, I'm in the dookie water. I don't want to be in the dookie water. Oh, damn. I'm about to come right over to the dookie. Okay. The dookie fall. Alright, what is this? The filing cabinet? What the fuck? Uh. Bro, I need to... <laughs> How do I get back? Uh, no. I'm just reload. To save. Sorry, guys. I don't know what the... Fuck is going on? This is some kind of glitch. Hey, Judy, what's up? Hey, can you come over, Stan? Something you know, happened. pizza lady, I yeah. cannot go alone. Just come. Yeah, I'm going to Judy. I'm going to go chill with Judy since you don't know what you're doing. My bicycle. All right, bro, you can keep talking, but until you move that gap, we ain't doing shit. All right, let me go. All right, get to ya. I'm 
security. I mean, at least you're not like a megaplex builder like me. Okay. Alright. Answer your door, homie. Oh. In the bathroom! Bird on herself to express her undying gratitude to you for saying. Stop talking. I was, I was only gone an hour. Gotta do something with her. Don't want any trouble. I'm calling the badges. Can you carry her to the bed? As if that'll change anything. I need to report an accidental death. North side, uh. Jackson Street. Oh. No. No imminent danger. <laughs> Suicide. Tomorrow. No. Today. What part of dead don't you understand? No, she was not pronounced dead by trauma team. If she'd have had coverage, we wouldn't be talking. And fuck you. If you don't want to move your asses, why don't I come down to the precinct and trash it into bits? Now will you come and arrest me, you pussies? Fine, I don't give a fuck what you write me up for. They'll be here soon. Jeez. They told me to keep her on ice until tomorrow. Can you believe the boss? Keep her on ice. That's kind of fucked up. I wouldn't want no fucking... That is crazy. Welcome to Night City. Where your address says more about you than anything else. We should have never come here. Put something on her. I'd rather she look like a person than a body. Oh, Did you man. wait outside? Close the door, V. Please. I'm a cig. Didn't know you smoked. <sighs> Quit. It's been years. But right now I need something besides air in my lungs. Please, V, just one. <laughs> Here. That was her smoke case. Want to hold on to it? No. You seem to like it. Keep it. Kind of glad it's you that has it, actually. I let her down. I thought if I gave her some t space and time, she'd get back on her feet. I don't know what to say. Never was any good at this stuff. Oh, you don't need to talk. I did more for her than anyone else. I had a motive to find her, Judy. You know that. It's what you bring that counts. You gave her the freedom to choose. Yeah, maybe. Just never imagined she'd choose this. Mm. 
Her condition couldn't mm. think about anything else. Tech wise, she was clean. Doll shard was operational, uncorrupted. So, psychological trauma had to be that. Did some more digging in her virtues, found Woodman. He kept her and had his way with her. The things he did. And once he got bored, he pawned her off. I zeroed Woodman. Didn't plan on it. Just how the chips landed. Glad I did, though. Me too. I can't even imagine. Still, it's not enough. There are so many more like him. Gotta be something I can do about it. Like what? Don't know yet. Think I'll call Sue's. Thanks, V. Sorry, but uh, I'd rather be alone now. Promise to keep in touch. Anything comes up, holler on the hollow. I think I'm gonna go talk to Wakako and call it a night, guys. Um, Finally, I have reached the point of sleeping. I feel like I've been up five days straight. But not really, I have to sleep here. Maybe two, three hours. But as I, you know, I'm rocking with it. Set guys.
jaggy bike. See a jaggy bike still. Or would you go? Now, I may not be good with names, but I do have quite a talent for faces. Where have I seen yours before? On the TV? Very unlikely. <laughs> but of course! Hideshi Hino! The man, the legend, in the flesh! Oh, you are just in time. Do you know who this is? Hideshi Hino, the late night comedy host! He was brilliant before he fell off the wagon. Can you still do your famous, better bugger up? No. Come on, you don't forget a thing like that. Just once, please. B, we should go in. Now. Fine, let's go. Hideshi Hino, to have fallen so far. Such a shame. Rogue, my sweet. This has got to be a misunderstanding. I've no idea who jumped your team, but the Claws? No, never. My boys know their place. I, I, I'm well, sorry, got to go. Sudden I change have in lighting. Guests. Oh, again. And one more time. V, so nice to see you. And your charming friend is. Happy to be working together. That's all. Takemura Goro des. Okada-san, oai dekite kohei des. Ah, a true gentleman. Ah, shame only that he's being hunted by all Arasaka's tin soldiers. And you, V, bring him to my door. Give me one reason why I shouldn't notify the proper authorities right away. Would have already made the call if you intended to. Simple. You're curious to see what we got. So tell me, and mark well I still have my phone at hand. Need intel on the parade that's scheduled to come through Japantown. So it's Arasaka. Again. What I fail to understand is... Why come to me? Did Mr. Deshaun not come to the phone? What is it? Goro, remind me why Dex's fat, backstabbing ass is currently indisposed. He is deceased. Butchered and dumped in a landfill by some Arasaka goon. Real shame that. Huh. That a threat I detect? No threat, no. Asked why I couldn't reach Dex, I answered. Just facts, nothing more. Good, cause you would then have to join him. Okada-san, our intentions are honorable. We need just information. It is a matter of life and death. Everything's on the shards. How much does this cost? My pockets are empty. Clearly. My gift to you, it's free. Okada-san, what is free often proves most costly? Gonna take them or not? For free? You sure? Got my reasons. But patience, I got none. Japan Town. Whole district is to be sealed off for the parade. 
Dashi platforms, the main attraction. They'll fly this way, high above street level. Hmm. Along the parade route, balconies, footbridges, and vantage points affording good views. Hanako Arasaka, the guest of honor, will deliver her speech from the largest float. She'll do this exactly here. Got no idea about security, but given recent events, expect it to be tight. Our last parade? Arasaka undercovers infiltrated the crowd. Not to mention a smattering of sharpshooters, drones. And if that's not enough fun for one day, a net runner, one at least. They use the city CCTV to observe everything. Main access point, here. It's an old automated control center. If you ask me, most useful by far. At the end, the floats will float out of Japantown, and we'll be left with trash up to our elbows that no one will collect. That's it. It's all I have. It must be enough. Then go. Be on your way. Thanks, Mukako. We appreciate this, Okada-san. Delightful, mature woman. This information, it could be just what we need. But I will try to investigate further. I will stay here some time and call some associates. The moment I learn something new, I will let you know. Just low profile, okay? Don't start handing out autographs. In fame, I could not overtake you if I tried. Be safe, B. You want trouble? <sighs> All right, guys. That is going to be the end of Cyberpunk 2077, episode eight for tonight. Yeah, wrapping it up. Ain't that right? I like your eyes. Cool. Yeah. Um. So like. Comment, subscribe. Um, yeah, share the video. When you subscribe, make sure you hit that notification bell so you can get some more videos. I'm coming out with a lot more stuff. Ooh. Um, but yeah, uh, see you guys around.